a letter written with the aid of using the past due Queen Elizabeth II that lies hidden in a vault in Australia cannot be opened for some other 63 years. The notice with the aid of using Her Majesty changed into written for the humans of Sydney and is secretly saved in one of the city's ancient old Queen Victoria building. The letter has been siding with inside the constructing already for almost 36 years because the Queen penned the notice in November 1986 on a kingdom go-to. Apparently, now no longer even the Queen's private group of workers recognize what changed into written at the notice aside from the stern commands at the, the front affirming, while it ought to be opened. The signed letter with the aid of using the Queen is addressed to the right and honorable Lord Mayor of Sydney, Australia. It reads, Greetings. On a appropriate day, to be decided on with the aid of using you with inside the years 2085 AD might you please open this envelope and bring to the residents of Sydney my message to them. The constructing changed into first opened in 1898 and named in honor of Queen Victoria's Diamond Jubilee. The British monarchy stays the top of kingdom in Australia, with King Charles represented with inside the United States of America with the aid of using Dave Hurley, the United States of America's Governor General. The past due Queen as head of kingdom might have been abolished in 1999, while the United States of America had a referendum to determine in the event that they desired to come to be a republic. Voters opted towards the extra D with 54 percentage of the populace affirming they would really like the Queen to stay as their head of kingdom. Her Majesty visited Australia's 16 exclusive instances at the same time as she changed into at the throne, together along with her first go to coming in 1954, simply years after she have become Queen, following the demise of her father King George VI. When the Queen visited the United States of America for the primary time in 1954, she changed into the primary reigning monarch to step foot on Australian soil. Princess Anne and her husband Vice Admiral Sir Timothy Lawrence additionally toured Australia in advance this year's. In that tour, Princess Anne opened 200 Sydney Royal Easter Show, which she first opened in 1970 together along with her mother and father and brother King Charles. Prince William and Kate Middleton, now Prince and Princess of Wales, have been additionally because of take it experience to Australia in 2020, however it changed into cancelled because of the COVID-19 pandemic. Greetings. On an appropriate day, to be decided on with the aid of using you with inside the years 2085 AD, please open this envelope and bring to the residents of Sydney my message to them, the letter reads. The QVB constructing opened in 1898 and changed into named in honor of Queen Victoria's Diamond Jubilee. The constructing changed into almost demolished for civic area and vehicle parking in 1959. The British monarch stays Australia's head of kingdom and King Charles is represented there with the aid of using the Governor-General. Republican sentiment keeps to bubble underneath the surface, however in a 1999 referendum Australians voted to hold the Queen as their head of kingdom. Her Majesty visited the United States of America 16 instances, together along with her first go-to in 1954, simply years after she ascended the throne. Other participants of the royal family have additionally visited Down Under, maximum these days Prince William and Kate Middleton in 2020. When Queen Elizabeth, then 27, landed at Sydney Airport, she have become the primary reigning monarch to set foot on Australian soil. According to reviews on the time, the Queen and the Duke of Edinburgh received the maximum tumultuous greeting Sydney has ever given to any visitor. Police estimates positioned the group of humans lining the city's streets at one million. The royal couple lower back to Australia in 1963 for Canberra's Jubilee celebrations, 50 years after the capital's naming. The Queen lower back to Australia in 1970 to assist have fun Captain James Cook's bicentennial crossing off the east coast of Australia. In 2009 it emerged that in that 1970 go to the royal couple changed into the goal of an assassination plot. Former Detective Superintendent Cliff McHardy stated the easy plan changed into to region a massive log of timber at the railway tracks and untry to derail the real educate. The educate hit the logs, however fortuitously remained at the tracks. More visits to Australia accompanied in 1973. 1974 and 1977 as Her Majesty helped Australia have fun crucial milestones. The Queen's very last go-to changed into dubbed her farewell tour, 
because it changed into taken into consideration possibly to be her remaining.